right. What was I gonna say? What am I doing? I'm wasting time. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. For those of you who are new around here, my name is Michael, aka Dr. Cellini, and today we're going to get straight into it because you probably clicked on this video because of the title. And we're going to be talking about my favorite apps for pre-medical students. So let's get into it. So let me find my thing here. All right, so let's go ahead and start off with my first favorite app for pre-med students, which is Evernote. Evernote has been coined the best note-taking app. In fact, I actually remember using it way back when I used to be in med school, and I think it started around the time I started my first year of med school, which was in 2011. I used to be obsessed with this app because for one, I just got an iPad, which was like the very first generation iPad at the time, and you could actually sync your notes from your iPad to your laptop, which, I mean, in 2011, this was like, mind-blowing technology here crazy but nowadays this is just like expected but you all will never have to experience this kind of stuff again but for me this was like groundbreaking stuff so i used to use this for that reason it was awesome we used to be able to take notes on my ipad and lecture and transfer them directly to my laptop it was phenomenal and i know it's only gotten better since then obviously i mean it's been 10 years now so the app has developed and is so much better than it used to be one of my favorite things about evernote is it gives you the ability to kind of search through all of your notes you can type in keywords you can search dates or whatnot that you had your lectures and it's just a way to keep everything organized you can also actually scan your handwritten notes into the app so again you have them in kind of one central location and i used to love this when i used to travel pre pandemic, especially in med school, I used to put everything into like my handwritten notes, I would scan them into my iPad, and I would just bring my iPad on the plane, and I would just travel with that instead of like 15 textbooks, my whole notebook, and all that kind of stuff. So I know I said this already, but I'll mention it again. You can track due dates, type notes, or scan your handwriting, and keep these with related handouts, web pages, and whiteboard pictures all in one place. And the best part about it is it is free of charge, but you can obviously upgrade for the more premium options or the business options as well. Next up, I wanna talk about my personal favorite app, which is created by my good friends over at MotivateMD, who happen to be sponsoring today's video. If you've been a longtime subscriber to my channel, you know I have worked with Motivate MD on multiple different occasions. The reason I worked with them so often is that one, they're the nicest people in the entire world, and two, they know exactly what they're doing in respect to the pre-medical space. They have helped countless number of pre-med students prepare and get into medical school. If you are new to Motivate MD, they are a company well known for their high value medical school application services and everything from essay reviews to interview prep. But on today's video, since we're talking about apps, we'll talk about the aptly named pre-med app offered by MotivateMD. There are a whole bunch of features of this app which I love, so let's go ahead and dive right in. For starters, you can set and crush individual goals from GPA to shadowing to volunteering, extracurricular activities, etc. It's essentially a place where you can keep track of all your shadowing, volunteering, research, and other extracurricular activities with their intuitive tracking software. Do you want to instantly communicate with doctors and medical students across the country who know what it takes to get into medical school? Well, you can do that with their My Mentor program. You have the opportunity to match with one of the mentors on their team, whether it be a medical student or a doctor. You can set your goals for the day, find motivation, and even learn something from the MCAT question of the day. The app is entirely designed to allow you to focus. Inspired by the study techniques of medical students, this scientifically proven productivity tool will keep you fresh and focused so you can study longer and more efficiently. With this app, you can also find the latest info on each MD and DO school in the US. Also, I want to reiterate that Motivate MD's team is highly composed of medical students. In fact, they have 60 plus medical schools represented on their team. Because of this, you may have the opportunity to reach out to medical students who go to the school that you want to go to. Just click on a button in the app and you'll see an option to message a medical student at that school. It's that easy. And it's available on mobile and web apps as well. You can access the app by downloading it to your phone or tablet, or you can just go to the website and browse that way. Also, there is a free subscription option that contains everything I just talked about. Also, Motivate MD is in constant communication with their web developers, and they are making constant improvements and enhancements to the app. In other words, this app is forever evolving, just like the people using it. Please be sure to check out the link in my description and check out Motivate MD pre-med app. All right, so next up on the list is an app called Headspace. Headspace has one primary mission, and that is to improve health and happiness throughout the world, which is a pretty good mission in my opinion. Headspace offers exercises to add extra mindfulness to your day and hundreds of meditations on everything from stress to sleep. 
And the other reason I love this app is because it is free as well, which I think you can actually upgrade to other things as well if you want, but more importantly, it's free. Now let's get to my next favorite app, which is an app called Forest. This is such a simple and unique app that makes you so productive. If you find yourself checking your phone constantly, scrolling through TikTok or Instagram, you may need something like this app to kind of take your mind off of that. So basically, you download the app, which I have on iOS, and you set a certain amount of time you wanna be productive for. So say you wanted to do a 30 minute block of studying. You set the timer for 30 minutes and you press go. When you press go, the app plants a seed. And as the time progresses, the tree or plant grows. However, if you leave the app for any reason or check your messages, you'll get an immediate notification saying that your plant or tree is dying if you don't return back to the screen. I wish I had this app when I was studying and well, I'm going to use this app when I study for future board examinations, but this is such an easy and simple way to keep you productive. It kind of just trains your mind to do things let the tree grow because you want to have a nice tree at the end of your study session. The whole point of the app is to use it multiple times so you have a complete forest of trees that you can kind of plant and plan your little park. I don't know. It's just kind of like a fun way to want to study. It may work for you. I love the idea. It's such a simple concept and I think you should all try it out. And finally, the last app we're going to talk about today is for all my caffeine and coffee shop lovers. This app is called Cafetivity. Is it cafetivity? Profitivity? Pro oh, profitivity. Sorry. <laughs> I thought it was cafetivity. It's coffetivity. This app is called coffetivity. Or as they say in New York, coffetivity as Andrana would say. Now, if you're like me, I used to love studying in the library, but there were plenty of times where I just would go to a coffee shop and sit there for like eight hours straight and study. I did this for a couple of different reasons. The most important reason is because you have an endless supply of caffeine and coffee, but I also did it because sometimes you just wanted to get out of that room in the library and experience life outside of that small cubicle or whatnot. Coffee shops provide that certain amount of background ambient noise that keeps you awake so you don't fall asleep while studying, but it also doesn't distract you because it's so random and ambient. So what this app does is essentially provide you with that ambient coffee background noise from anywhere. So rather than having to go to a coffee shop, you can actually just have that ambient noise in the background to help you study or do whatever you want to do and be more productive. So the good thing about Coffitivity is you can have that background ambient noise from a coffee shop anywhere you want. It just goes through your headphones by going to their website and listening to whatever background ambient coffee shop noise you wanna to listen to. I think they also have an app where you can upgrade a little bit to get more ambient noises at different places, but the coffee shop one is actually exceptional and sounds just like a coffee shop. So if you're one of those people who loves studying in a coffee shop and loves that ambient noise, this might be a good option for you. The only downside is that you don't get the coffee with this app, you just get the benefits of being in a coffee shop. All right, so that concludes this video. Hope you all enjoyed some of these apps and I hope you all use them. If you have an app that you think others would benefit from and you want to share it with everybody else on this channel, leave it in the comments below. If it's a solid app, I'll pin the comment. Otherwise, if you have any other questions, leave a comment below as well. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram. I always post over there. It's like what I do in between YouTube. So follow me over there. And thanks again for Motivate MD for sponsoring this video. Make sure you check the link in my description to check out the pre-med app. Otherwise, I'll see you all on the next video. See you.